Hi guys, so welcome back on Jackdown Farms, your favorite channel where you get to learn everything catfish farming. So I'm sure you've heard of probiotics. There are so many misconceptions about probiotics. People tend to even take probiotics as antibiotics. No, they are two different things altogether. So today I'm here to clarify the difference between probiotics and antibiotics and to give you where probiotics are needed, when they are needed and how they are used on fish farms. Stay tuned. So here is the difference between probiotics and antibiotics. Antibiotics are a blend of chemicals which are used to prevent bacterial infections or fight against bacterial infections in living organisms. And probiotics are a blend of live bacteria which is used to also fight bacterial infections in livestock and living organisms at large. So probiotics have been used for centuries and then recent studies show that probiotics can do more than just the treatment of uh, bacterial infection or the prevention of bacterial infection, but then they can also improve the growth rate of your livestock. Example of probiotics that have been used for centuries is the lactic acid bacteria, which is commonly used in uh, yogurt production, cheese production, and so forth. So come around, let me show you where I use probiotics in my beneficiary bacteria form and how I apply it. So, so this is my biological chamber for my RAS system and then this is an example of probiotics that I use in my pond. I don't want to advertise for someone for free though, but this is an example of a probiotics that I use. For my viewers, I can show you the brand as well. This is uh, from NutriFarms and then this is how I apply it. It comes in a powdered form, so I just dissolve it in a solution before pouring it in my uh, rash chamber. So I dissolve the solution right here. Of course you need to measure, but I've been doing this for a long time, so I know the quantity that is required for me. This is how everything looks like. So I just spread it in my biological chamber. And I have some form of gravel as well in there to promote the growth of beneficiary bacteria in my pond. So guys, this is how I apply my probiotics on my farm and then it helps a lot. It helps a lot. I hardly have probably bacteria infections. No, I've never recorded such things on my farm because of the biosecurity measures I put in place always to prevent that. Probiotics are not only used for rat systems, you know, you can mix it with your feed as well to have some to, to, to attain some form of protection against bacterial infections and then to boost the immune system of your fishes as well. For all livestock, I should say, if you are into poultry farming, you can do that. If you are into goat farming, animal uh, 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 cattle farming, you can do that as well. So this is, these are my ponds. So the water from the filtering system you saw earlier right outside after the filtration is done the water is being pumped right or dispensed into these ponds so if you need a setup just like this one a recirculating aquaculture system just like this if you want if you need a bioflot system a farm a complete farm setup farm automation you can contact your dam farms and we'll serve you right Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day. Bye-bye.